What's up YouTube, HPK back with another video. And today we're gonna be looking at which Julie cleaning product would be the best for you and which I think is the personal best. Let's get into it. So before we get in this video, I just wanna say thank you to all my new subscribers. And if you don't know, we've hit 100 subscribers. Um, so if you're seeing this video and you haven't subscribed, please subscribe, because 99% of you aren't. Anyways, I only have 1% that's uh, watched these videos that subscribe. Anyways, um, before I get in depth about all these really products, I just want to say um, these two are just your standard from Walmart, the wipes and the solution. Um, so your wipes, obviously it's just uh, it's your standard old wipe. You got your, uh, your cleaning side and all you do is just grab your chain, give it a nice rub. I don't know if I'm getting this on camera, but and then you go to your buffing side, give it a nice rub. And what I think this is used for, my opinion, is your flat link chains, like your uh, curbside link, your Miami's Cubans, all that kind of stuff. Um, the reason why I say that is because it's pretty flat, usually clean, but these ropes, um, it's really hard to get in there and uh, clean those uh, links. But uh, you know, all these Miami Cubans, um, it's really easy to get in there and clean. Um, so yeah, wipes, I would say it's for your flat, flat facing uh, links. And then we have our, uh, just our cleaning solution here. So let's open this up. Um, I need to get a new one. This was a couple of years old, so it's really gross. And you have a little tray, you drop your chain in this little tray, let it soak for 30 seconds, take it back out, and then rinse it off in some water. Now what I think that one is good for is your rope chains, anything with a uh, link that's hard to get into the crevices. And why I say don't use, why I'm saying that and don't, don't use this for the the, 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 the flat facing surfaces because I really do think the, the the rag works a lot better than the cleaning solution just sending it in the cleaning solution so I would I would personally suggest the rag if you have any flat facing uh, chains but anything like a uh, a rope where it's hard to get in those links I would recommend the solution now you're going to be asking about this in here this I don't know the actual term for it but it's a uh, it vibrates like really really fast or does very microscopic vibrations whatever you want to say so it just vibrates from jewelry and gets all that uh, oil and gunk out but you can use just uh, a, a drop of soap in some water and it does work decently good but if you want it to actually perform like it should you need a special cleaning solution for this so unless you are a jewelry cleaning store or you have a big jewelry collection i do not recommend this it's a waste of money um and yeah that's it if you wanted me to go on depths and show you how uh do a video on each of these on how i use them and if i got 100 likes i will buy the cleaning solution for this and uh show you how it works so get me to 100 likes and i'll show you how that works with the proper cleaning solution anyways hbk signing out